What's going on guys? So today I'm going to be talking about White Door 7 is a firmware for iPhone 2G, 3G, iPod Touch 1G and 2G and it lets you load iOS 7 onto your phone. It's a really really well designed tweak to make it run and look just like iOS 7. So let's see, take a look at the features. So as you can see here, these are screenshots from White Door and it looks just like iOS 7. So it has all the iOS 7 themes, icons, push notifications, and all of these, they look exactly like the iOS 7 for the newer devices. One really cool thing is that there's multiple app stores. So you can do the official app store, you can do Cydia, and you can also do App Time Machine, which lets you get older versions of apps to run on your phone. There's a new camera app, multitasking, control center, voice control. I mean, the list goes on and on, it's awesome. So as I said, it's available for iPhone 2G, 3G, and the iPod Touch 1G and 2G. And the cool thing is now you can do it on iPod Touch 2G, but the MC model. So previous versions of White Door didn't allow you to do that. That's a pretty cool new feature. So let's take a look at how to install it. First, you need to pick your model. So I'm just going to pick iPhone 3G. And then you choose if you're on Windows or Mac. Now, these are the same exact steps regardless. Um, you just need to push a different key combo. So I'm going to choose Windows. First, you need to download the firmware. So you download that. Now, if you're choosing an iPhone, it'll ask you if you want the normal or the unlocker. So the key for this one is, is your phone factory unlocked or is it not? That's pretty self-explanatory, but basically you just download whichever firmware corresponds with your device. First, so this is where it's a little bit different, is you use Red Snow. It's included here. So you're going to download this, open Red Snow, and then enter the Pwn DFU mode. And so that's pretty simple. You just hit extra tools and then you just shift restore on iTunes or option restore with Mac and you choose the white door software which is and .ipsw from the download folder and then you just let it run just like a normal restore software upgrade and when your phone reboots it'll have iOS 7 on it so tell me what you think if you've tried white door 7 let me know how it works for you leave any questions or comments you have uh, down below